Welcome back everyone. This video is a tribute to all the stars who created wonderful memories for us, and we honor their lasting legacy. But before we start, let me know if you recognize any of the following actors and actresses. When did you notice them for the first time and how old were you? Do you have any particularly nostalgic recollections of them? Let me know in the comments section below. The American actress Junin Clay starred in the film's War Games and The Legend of the Lone Ranger. Clay was a contender for the role of Wilma Deering in Buck Rogers in the 25th century, but lost the role when Erin Gray returned to reprise her role from the theatrical release. Clay died on March 12, 1995, after a lengthy illness. Karen Steele was an American actress best known for her work in film and television. She was born in Illinois and began her acting career in the early 1950s. Steele's first acting gig was on the radio show Let George Do It. Steele passed away in 1988 at the age of 56 from complications related to cancer. Lynn Thigpen was an American actress best known for her work on stage and in television and film. She was born in Illinois and began her acting career in the 1970s, appearing in a number of off-Broadway productions. Thigpen's breakout role came in 1981 when she played the role of the radio DJ in the film The Warriors. Thigpen passed away in 2003 at the age of 54 from a cerebral hemorrhage. Maria Magdalena Guzman Garza, better known as Magda Guzman, was a Mexican actress and television personality. She died of heart failure in Mexico City at the age of 83. Maurice Evans was a British-born actor and director who is best known for his work in theater and on television. He began his career on the stage in the 1920s and became a well-respected Shakespearean actor, playing roles such as Hamlet, Macbeth, and Richard II. In Rotting Dean, East Sussex, England, Evans died of heart failure caused by bronchitis at the Coogan played Captain Video in Captain Video and his Video Rangers between 1949 and 1950, and he was best known as an actor. He was a professional golfer and golf instructor in later life. Coogan died a few weeks before his 100th birthday on March 12, 2014, in Los Angeles from natural causes.